Hey y'all, it's Johnny with RV SWAT. Are you a nomad that orders from Amazon and wonders where to get your packages delivered? Stick around and we'll show you the answer. First of all, I want to wish everybody a happy Thanksgiving. I hope you had a great day and filled your bellies up with food like we did. Guys, right, so we discovered a, a new feature, well, new to us anyway, called Amazon Locker. So if you're out on the road and you're ordering something from Amazon and not sure where to get it delivered to, I mean, we could have it sent to our mail forwarding service in South Dakota, but then we would have to pay them uh, shipping to actually get it to wherever we're at. So I discovered Amazon Locker. And basically, it's just a set of lockers set outside of businesses uh, all over the place. Uh, I found one about, I don't know, I guess about 15 minutes down the road. It's actually on our way to work. So I ordered something and had it delivered to the locker, and then we picked it up there, and everything worked out fine, and I think it's a, a great service. So if you stick around to the end of the video, we'll actually take you along for the ride, and we'll go pick something up at the locker. But... I know, you know, I talk to a lot of people that are on the road, and, and that's always a big concern, is, you know, I need to order something from Amazon, but I'm in travel mode, you know, I'm not going to be at my destination for a week or whatever. All you have to do is know where you're going to be in two days, order Amazon Prime, you know it's going to be there in two days, pull up a zip code for that area, and then find a locker nearby. Now, I will say, I noticed, you know, the lockers aren't everywhere right now. Uh, I found one nearby here. I found one, you know, I searched a couple places I'm passing through, and they had them. But there's a bunch of places that don't have them yet. But I did read that they're popping up more and more, uh, more often. So I would say, you know, in a year's time, it's going to be like Redbox. They're going to be all over the place. So anyway, stay tuned. We'll go over to the computer. We'll order something on Amazon, and we'll run over to the locker and pick it up. If you have any questions about anything, comment below, and I'll try to get them answered the best I can. All right, guys, let's take a look at Amazon Locker. So we're going to go through the process of purchasing something and having it shipped to an Amazon Locker. So let's look at a uh, DSLR lighting and microphone. I know there's one that I want that I've already looked at, which is this one. So basically, find whatever item that you're going to purchase, add it to your cart, and then go ahead and proceed to checkout. When you sign into your account, you're going to see your shipping address, and you're going to change your shipping address, and we're going to find an Amazon locker near you. So when you go to change your shipping address, if you look down at the bottom, right here where it says your pickup locations, this is where all your Amazon lockers are going to be located. So if we want to find a new one, let's say I was passing through, I'm traveling through Louisiana, let's say I'm going to be passing through Baton Rouge. Oh, that's a zip code around there, I know. Uh, 70737. So wherever you know you're going to be in a couple of days if you're ordering Prime, put in that zip code and hit search, and it's going to find the Amazon lockers in that area. So you'll see there's one in Baton Rouge on uh, Corporate Boulevard. So if I'm passing down I-10 anyway, I-10 and I-12, it's right off the interstate. So we're going to ship it to this address. And you'll see it sets it up here in your shipping address to the Amazon locker. Now everything else, I'm not going to go any further than this because I don't need everyone to see my payment information and all that stuff. But basically, I just wanted to show you the, the shipping portion of it. So you place your order, you find a locker, and then you go through the order process. And then once you place your order, you'll get an email whenever it's delivered. And I'll show you what that email looks like here in just a second. Once you place your order, once your package is delivered, you know, here's your Amazon, you know, your order confirmation, and then it's been shipped. And you'll get one that says your package is ready for pickup from Amazon Locker, right? So you open that email, and like I said, I opened it on my phone, and you'll see the barcode here. So this is the barcode that you're going to take to the locker. So we arrived at the Amazon Locker. So all I'm doing is pulling up, get to my email, and there's my Amazon confirmation. So this shows me it's in the locker, scan this barcode. 
and it should open the locker and get our stuff. So let's step out and see if this will work. All right, Amazon locker. What does it say? There's no other stuff, so I guess just scan this right here. Enter your code. Yes, that's it. Popped open, look at there. Popped open. Yep, there's our stuff. Yeah. That was easy. That was easy. All right, that was easy enough. We scanned the barcode that was in the email. So the locker just popped open. So if you look, the lockers aren't even numbered. So you have no idea what's in what. So you just scan your barcode and then your door pops open automatically and your stuff is in there. So I would hopefully say- Hopefully that's our LED lights. Yeah, well, it's got our name on it. So <laughs> hopefully they sent their home the right well, thing. Well, it's not the dog bed, so. Yeah, true. So yeah, I would say uh, absolute nomad friendly service so if you're ordering something from amazon and worried about where to ship it find a locker near you if you know or, or a locker where you you know around where you're going to be in two days you can have it you know sent right to the locker and picked up so i like it let's go to work let's go to work all in all i think amazon locker is a great service you have to research you know depending on what you order there are some restrictions uh, we notice there's size restrictions for certain lockers there's weight restrictions things like that so you have to look at what you're ordering and make sure it can fit in the locker good news is if it can't fit whenever you choose the locker it'll tell you that you know you can't do it we ordered a pet bed that's on the dashboard back here for gadget and I tried to send it to the locker and it told me that it was it was too large for the locker so you know I say order find a locker if it has any restrictions then you just have to get it delivered somewhere else but all in all I like the service so if you like the video give us a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe and uh, click the bell if you want notifications up, and we'll catch you in the next one. Have a good one.